Hey guys, this is Ryan from ryrob.com. And in this video, we're talking about how to start a blog, more specifically, how to register your domain name, pick the right hosting plan and get your blog online live on the internet today for everyone to come and read your content, to engage with you, to watch your videos, to build relationships with you. Now, right here, we're on my guide to starting a blog on the side and how to make money from your blog in 2019. Now, this guide is constantly updated. So if you're watching this afterwards, do not worry. I'm always updating the content to make sure it's very relevant to you and to what's happening today. Now, in this guide, I'm talking about everything from the very tactical step-by-step -step process for getting your blog live and online in just a few minutes. And on this guide, we also cover everything from driving traffic to your blog, how to find readers online, how to leverage social media channels, and then how to actually generate revenue with these readers in a win-win way. Now, first things first, we're here to register your blog to get it online, right? So you'll see right here, this very clear call out, the essential first step to starting a blog today is actually getting your domain and choosing hosting. Now, I've gone out and brokered a 65% off discount for you to sign up with my hosting company of choice that I personally use. It's called Bluehost. Now, Bluehost has been around for years and years and years. They're very seasoned veterans in this hosting game, and they have the best support. That's why I chose them. So go ahead and click on this Get Domain and Hosting Now, and then we'll get started. So you'll immediately be taken over here to this dedicated page. Now, this page already has your discount loaded and preloaded right here. And this get started now button will begin our process for setting up. Now, you'll see here that normal pricing is $7.99 a month right now. And my discount to you makes it $2.95 a month. And here on Bluehost, what you're getting when you register your domain name is you're getting the domain for free included in this plan that you're going to be choosing. Now, you get the automatic WordPress install, which makes it super easy to install WordPress. And that's WordPress is the choice CMS, the content management system to use to power your blog. And they make it super duper easy by having just a one click install to get started. Now, You'll also get 24 seven support. And that means you get people to chat with whenever you have technical issues or questions or problems that you need troubleshooted. You get someone who's a rep to help you through this, right? And that's worth so much compared to many other hosting companies that don't offer such a service. And you also get a 30 day money back guarantee in case things don't go as planned. So let's go ahead and get started now. Click this green button. And we're going to go over to this plan where you're or to this page where you're going to select your best plan. Now, personally, I recommend going with the Choice Plus plan. Um, and that's for one main reason. You can check out all the different options that they have between Basic Plus and Choice Plus. Um, however, between Plus and Choice Plus, they're the same price. So always go with the Choice Plus. You're going to get more. And what you're getting in the Choice Plus plan, why I recommend this to all of my readers, is that you're going to be getting the domain privacy. Now, I want to take just a quick minute to talk about domain privacy because you'll see it's not offered in the normal basic plan that you get. So the basic is cheaper. However, with Choice Plus, you get domain privacy. And domain privacy, let me tell you, is super important because when I first started creating websites and blogs online, um, I didn't have domain privacy. And over the course of the months and years after I started those websites, I was getting phone calls um, and emails from spam callers and you would get offered lots of different scams and people that are just sort of wasting your time reaching out to you because the way that internet laws work, you have to publicly publish the owner's contact information for any website that goes live. Now, what that means is if you do not have domain privacy, you're going to have your name, your phone number, your home address, your email address, all published online. And with domain privacy, why I recommend the Choice Plus plan from Bluehost, you get this information concealed. So Bluehost will act as a privacy barrier for you. They're going to protect your contact information so that people can't message you with spam or scam offers. So again, this is a simple choice. Go with the Choice Plus. Um, you're going to benefit from it. I can promise you. Now, once you select the plan that you want to use, the next step is 
actually choosing your domain name. So if you have a domain name that you want to sign up, if it's a domain name you already own, you just want to get it hosted, then you can go ahead and type it in here. But for most of you, you're going to be registering a brand new domain. Now, I want to say, do not overthink what your domain name should be. This is something that can grow and evolve over time. You can change it as you learn and you grow and you, you decide what you want to blog about if it's something different than what you start with today. But my advice, if you cannot think of a domain name that you want to register, just choose yourname.com um, or come up with some sort of nickname or a clever uh, version of your name, a play on words. Um, don't overthink this. Really, really, really um, encourage you to get started just today. So with this domain, I've been thinking about launching a travel blog on the side. So I'm going to say let's travel the globe com. Now you can choose different domain extensions. Um, Bluehost offers options to choose .online, .site, .website, .blog, .store, .net, .org. There's a lot of different options, uh, but I still recommend going with the .com if you possibly can, just because that's much more popular still on the internet today. Um, however, it's not a big deal if you decide to go with a .co, a .blog, .net. Um, it's not a really big deal. Um, readers have gotten much more accustomed to different domain extensions. So again, don't overthink this. Choose your domain name. Click the next button. And now we're going to get over to the account information page. Now, we have chosen our hosting plan at this stage. We've chosen our domain name. And now it's time to finalize things. So Bluehost has this one-click integration with Google Sign-On. So if you use Gmail for your email and all of your other personal um, data, then you can click this sign in with Google and it's going to populate this information automatically. Um, but uh, I'm gonna just type in all of my information here. Um, most of you will probably go with this route. And so let's go with that. Fill in all of your personal information um, and then your package information, right? So this is what we chose on the previous uh, page. Let's travel the globe.com. That's the website I'm registering. I want to do the uh, Choice Plus, also known as Prime plan for 36 months. Um, that's what I'm locking in at $5.45 a month. Now you do have the option here to choose a plan that locks you in for longer or shorter durations um, for different price points. But again, I recommend this $5.45 a month for 36 months. And this Let's Encrypt SSL. Let me tell you about what this is. So if you go to, uh, you know, even on this page, actually, or on my website, you'll see a little lock right here, a little lock icon in the address bar. And this, this uh, uh, your website address will start with HTTPS. Now, the S stands for secure. And this lock also signifies secure. Now, this Let's Encrypt SSL is a secure certificate that shows your website is secured. Now this makes it more secure for the readers who are coming to your site. They have a direct connection to your blog. And this is something that search engines place a lot of value on. If you don't have this Let's Encrypt SSL certificate, then that's a negative sign. And, and it makes your site more secure. This is something that used to cost a ton, but today um, it's become commonplace for it to be lumped in with, uh, you know, Bluehost in particular, their plans include this. So it's a major value add. Now, package extras, this is something where you have the option to include other basic sort of add-ons to your plan. Now, personally, um, you know, the domain privacy protection, that's free. That's included when you choose the Choice Plus or the Prime plan. Now, the site lock security, there are plenty of other tools and WordPress plugins and, and things out there that can give you extra additional security. And in my guide, I talk about different security plugins that you can use to secure your website better. So I'm going to uncheck this. I don't personally need this. Um, however, if you want the site lock security, you definitely can. Um, Code Guard Basic, that's included again. Um, and the Bluehost SEO tools, um, this is something that was unchecked. Um, and there are plenty of other tools that are free and similar priced that I'm going to recommend in my guide to starting a blog. So I would leave this unchecked as well. And that brings us to our total now. And at this stage, you can enter your credit card information, <laughs> which I'm not going to type in here. Um, and then once you're ready to go, you're going to click the you've read the terms and conditions and submit. 